I'm asked very often, what is a medical food? It's a, a category that has some growth in other areas of medicine. Inborn errors of metabolism is one example where medical foods are very common. Uh, within the eye care space, medical foods really aren't that well known. And there's never really been a medical food product within eye care before. So the medical food designation, if you think of a regulatory spectrum with nutritional supplements at one end and pharmaceuticals at the other. Nutritional supplements can be brought to market with no trials. Um, you're not allowed to make specific disease claims with nutritional supplements. <laughs> pharmaceuticals, you need to go through phase one, two, three. You have to have pre-market approval before you launch and you have to be very specific about the claims that you make about what those drugs are going to treat. Medical foods sit right in the middle. So the medical food category is a distinct category regulated by the FDA, and you don't need pre-market approval to bring a, a medical food to market, but that space is monitored post-market introduction. So when you label your product, you have to make very specific claims about what that product is doing and the disease or condition that it's treating. So we specifically treat a depleted macular pigment. The medical food is designed solely to rebuild that macular pigment and maintain it for the long term. Medical foods as a category are described as products that are designed specifically to treat a disease or condition based on specific dietary requirements which cannot be met through modifications to normal diet alone. So that's really where the medical food designation sits and that's why we decided to go into that space and create that differentiation within the market.